you were going to wear, right? Uh, so you think you will use this cursed pregnancy to trap my son into marriage, eh? Right? Oh, madam, so, so why are you trying to ruin my sister's happiness? Oh, look at this fat boy! Will you shut up before what I do woman? You? What is your problem? You think you will just walk into somebody's compound and start shouting like a white dog? You have what a house? Is Who are you? Madam, just hold this one first! <laughs> and that's for you!
I'll be back. Stay here in case in case Sophia's coming. It's okay, my daughter. Just, just. Love is a journey. Turns us around and around. It's life above money. Feeling we want to Ladies and gentlemen, Everybody, Tony. I've seen Tony, what is happening? Where are you? Are you in the church? Yes, I am outside the church, and the pastor is already waiting. Okay, you let them wait. I'm just taking care of the situation. All right. Bye bye. Hello. 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 So let us hold on strong, 'cause love always comes at us. Oh, let us hold on strong. Love always wins it all. Oh, let us hold on strong. Cause love always comes at all. Objections arise and them turn all apart. I'm feeling the heat and it's tearing my heart. I can't burn the candle from both ends alright. That's just the reason I'm feeling this fight. <laughs> Why isn't she picking the phone? She knows it's me calling. Love is a journey, turns us around and around. It's life above money, feeling we want to abound. Ladies and gentlemen, our lives by Jason. Let's wear a bottle of water by your side. Everybody, 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 say. Hello. Hello, Tony. Yeah, my brother, man. There's a problem. Yeah, I think you should just start coming straight to um, Christ the King Hospital at um, this village. What was the name? Up by now. Fred, I'm trying to find a way of how I can locate Sophia. What am I going to do to the remote area? Listen, Tony, listen. I'm sorry to say this, but Sophia has been involved in a ghastly motor accident. What? What did you say? What? I think she was driving up the town, maybe to somewhere she wanted to sit down and whatever. 
somehow I think she lost control of it. Man, honestly, the car had my tired to be on the bed, honestly. Just, just start coming down. What's the name of the hospital? Um, Christ the King Hospital. I forgot my name. You know that village, man. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm on my way. Is she going to survive? Yes, she will survive. This situation is not terribly bad. It's okay, Tony. I don't want you to worry yourself. Tony, I told you this thing before. This is a very critical moment. A very serious moment of temptation. You just have to deal wisely with this whole thing. Quit worrying. But why should this happen on my wedding day, right? Of all days, why this day? This is supposed to be one of the happiest days in my life. Um, I'm sorry, sir. She has lost the privilege. What did you say? What? What? There is equally a serious damage to her womb. And medically, I can confirm to you that she will not be able to proceed again. Oh, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Nevertheless, she will survive. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Yeah, but she will survive. She will survive. Okay. My God. Mom, what you did is very, very wrong. It's wrong, Mom. If that girl dies eventually, her blood is on her head. There's a push side to that accident. I put it to you that you're an idiot. A complete idiot. Oh, what do you want? You and your brother, you want to end up marrying people without moral values? You are very stupid. Hey, 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 hey. Yes, you stop it, stop it. Let me alone, let me alone. You see what you've caused? You see what you've caused? And you made her have, have an accident, and she's lost her pregnancy. So you now have the effort to attack me because I'm a useless girl, right? I want you. I want you not to marry my girl. But no, you refused. Mom, why? Mom, stop now. Please shut up. Shut up and get out of my side. Oh, the think of you. Think you can put me to shame. I, Madam Bakasi, right? Oh no. I'm sorry to disappoint you this time. Hey, listen to me, man. Leave me alone, man. Leave me alone. We have enough problems on our hands already, okay? Uh -huh. Just calm down. No, Please, leave everybody, him. calm down. No, leave him to beat up his mom. Calm I'm down. out of here anyway. I want you, didn't I? You want to beat me because of some useless girl.
not to tell me you're sorry. Now will you pick up that bus? Pick up the, the bag. Who are you? To push down my bag? Are you crazy or something? I just said I was sorry. Just like that? Just like that. Just like that. I mean, I've never been so embarrassed all my life. It was no name she didn't call me. No name she didn't call me, despite my apologies. What did the people around say? I mean, did they do something? Did they try to help you? Well, they were all shocked. You know, everybody was shocked. I just, I held myself back because I didn't want to be important. The market. I held myself back. This is strange. Right, did you get hurt? I hope you're fine. No, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. You? I have got home washed up. Hey, but I'm just shocked. You know? You have to really do that. chance to talk to me because you should be talking to me if there's anything that should be explained it should be coming from you that's why I'm listening because I don't know have you met my mother before now she it was the woman I told you slapped me at the market and poured oil on me what <laughs> I didn't do anything to her on that faithful day. I didn't do anything to her. <laughs> yeah, I understand. I can't even laugh. Are you telling me this is this trivial thing that is bringing about all this commotion? <laughs> no. It's okay. I believe you 100%. I believe you. 
and I know to what extent my mother can go. The things that she can do, it's all right. Don't cry. Who solved this? I mean, I'll talk to her. I need nobody's apology. You're not a wife material. You can never marry my son. So Mother, you overreacted. Get out of my house and out of my son's life. Mom, I think you overreact. Whatever happened that day was an accident. And she's apologizing regardless. What's the problem? Will you shut up? Can't you see? I don't need anybody's apology. There's, 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 there's nothing about her that shows that she will make a good wife. You cannot marry her. I'm very sorry, Mom. Please. You know what, Mom? I'm done with this. I am done with this! Why are you taking this out of proportion? You were the one to slap her in the first place. You poured oil on her and she's apologizing. You still don't want to do this. Shut up! What do you know? Were you there? She was the one that poured the oil on herself. Now just, just look at her. No traits of a wife. Look at her from head to toe. You are not going to marry her. Oh, my son will not marry her. Oh, please don't touch me. Get out of my house. Get out of my house. Stop it. Stop it. What's wrong with you? What do you mean what's wrong with me? I said to my head, oh! She's apologizing. So and you what? still don't say it. You don't, you don't see it? I oh, know I don't. I don't see it! your problem! I don't have any problem. I should be asking you that question. You're like a rock. What happened was not my fault. Was it? I know. It's okay. You'll be fine. The doctor has confirmed that you'll be fine. You'll be just fine. I've done everything I can to make you reason. You refuse. All you want to do is conclude that she's a prostitute, she hasn't got good behavior, she can't be a good wife. Why? Because of some stupid misunderstanding you had in the marketplace? Is that why? Are you daring me? I'm not daring you, but I don't understand what is happening. What is wrong? Besides, she's pregnant for me. <laughs> yes, and I'm going to marry her whether you like it yeah. or not. Okay, that all makes sense. I guess they told you that once you mention that she's pregnant, I'll be so happy and allow you to marry her. Well, too bad, son, because I'm not going to change my mind. And you better tell her that that thing she's carrying is cursed. Excuse me. Well, at the end of the day, it's my decision to make. I'm going to marry her, whether you like it or not. I'm the one who's going to stay with her, not you. Oh, it's 
being here. What do you mean? You mean you're still, you're still going to marry me? She asked me the same question in the hospital. I was blank. I didn't know what to say. But you can trust me. Considering the fact that it's me and my mother that is causing her with this trauma, it would only be fair I, I stick by her, right? Mom, 
listen, you know initially I was against the action you took. But now I support you fully. Mom, I want you to do everything, I mean everything within your past to make sure that brother does not get married to a barren woman. <laughs> Tony dares me. Tony dares to bite the breasts that he suckled. He dares to kick against the stomach that carried him for nine good months. As long as I live, Tony will never marry that girl. Mm. Are you aware that he says that you're the one that is responsible for the accident? <laughs> he can say whatever he likes. That's his business. All that would not have happened if he had listened to me in the first place. I mean, why would a son, for crying out loud, want to marry a girl that disgraced his mother in the marketplace of all places? Get married secretly. He's planning to wed her secretly. Whether openly or secretly, that marriage will never hold. I trust you. Except they both want to die and go and marry in the great beyond. I trust you. I am Madame Pakasi. Nothing, absolutely nothing happens with her. And as for that girl, I am going to deal with her. For coming to ruin my son's life. Anyway, enough of those people. Darling, can you go upstairs and get me some vitamin C? I think I'm coming down with a cold. Oh, sorry. Tony, Tony, you want to bite the hand? son is planning a secret wedding? Yes, I'm aware. You are aware? And you support him? Well, Tony is my friend. I have to support him in whatever he wants to do. I see. I understand you're the only son of your family, right? Yeah, I'm the only son. Why, why are you asking me all these questions? I know I'm asking a lot of questions, but I actually need you to answer me objectively. As the only son of your family, would you marry that kind of woman that Tony wants to marry? Well, I'm sorry, ma'am. But you know that Tony is a full-grown man. I don't make decisions for him. I don't make choices for him. And I believe that if he has chosen to marry Sophia, Irrespective of the situation, I think you should support him. I put it to you that you're a bad man. A very, very bad man. So if you were in Tony's shoes, you would actually go ahead and marry a woman that the doctors have certified barren? Oh, you are evil. Very evil. And you see, all you evil men around Tony, I will deal with you one by one. Today. Brother, I'm not staying. I'm not staying. Sadik is there. You can take care of them. Sadik cannot do it. 
I need you to stay here, no, take I care of the people, so you leave them. I want to come with you guys. I don't want to stay. Please stay, stay, wait for me. I'm coming. It says stay back. Some people are coming, you pick them and bring them in 20 minutes, okay? okay. I want to come, I don't sorry, want to stay. Sorry, sorry, stay back. Love is a journey, turns us around and around. It's life above money, feeling we want to abound. Between our lives fighting, let's slow this fighting. If only this love could be left. Make sure the end is in the I've seen lives of people. Tied in of Stephen, only because of their bond. So let us hold on strong. Cause love always wins it all. So let us hold on strong. Cause love always comes out. Jill, Jill, are you there? I'm almost at the house. So what's going on with you? Mom, they just left. Where are you? They just left? Where? Come, driver, Madam. did you see any car decorated with balloons? Like a car heading for a wedding? Madam, I didn't see any decorated car, madam. Just, just move fast, move okay, fast, please. Okay, madam. Between our lives fighting, Hello, Mom. let's slow Hello. this fighting. If only this love could be left to grow. I've seen lots of people they're not even only because of their bond so let us hold on strong cause love always wins it all so let us hold on strong cause love always comes at all oh let us hold on strong Cause love always wins it all Oh let us hold on strong Jay! Jay, where are you? Yes, Mom. What are you doing here? I asked you to follow them to the wedding. That was my instruction. Yes, Mom, but brother said I shouldn't ride with them. He said I should stay behind that some people are coming. I will send somebody to come and pick us up. Oh my god. So where's the wedding holding? They kept changing their plans. But what I gathered finally is that the wedding will hold in a school, but I don't know the name of the school. Oh, Jane, 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 must you disappoint me? I'm sorry. Anyway, you know what? Just stay back here and wait in case somebody comes, all right? Just make sure you give me a call, all right? Okay. I'll rush off now. Objections arise and them turn all apart. I'm feeling the heat and it's tearing my heart. I can't burn the candle from Sassy, both ends of Do you know why your guys having his wedding? That's just the reason I'm feeling this fight Up in the sky, down in the air You're the one that I love for life So hold on strong As love always wins it up So let us hold on strong Cause love always comes at top Oh let us hold on strong Cause love always wins it all Oh let us hold on strong Cause love always comes at top actually invited for the wedding, but I lost my invitation card. Do you know where the venue is? Are you sure you are in the right place? Is this not Sophia's house? Yeah, this is Sophia's house. Yes. But they said they needed the wire to wedding. Even they didn't even print an invitation card. I know, but uh, I want to attend the wedding. Do you know where the venue is? No, I don't know. I don't know. Never we are not invited at all.
But there's supposed to be a wedding going on inside the school. Uh, okay, thank you very much. They asked the me ring. not to tell you. Take it easy. Okay, but they've gone to get new ones. He is going that's... back home? No. He did not go home. He wants to get it around here. Okay? Just calm down. Okay, calm better down. Better get here fast. Better get here fast. Because I'm running out of patience. Calm down. Marriage. You do? Where? Mom, just go straight to Queen's College. I'll be there very soon. I'm waiting for a text, okay? I will join you there soon. Just go straight to that place now. Driver, do you know where Queen's College is? That's almost 20 kilometers from here, madam. And there's traffic on the road. Listen, I don't care if there are roadblocks. You can find a shortcut to that place. Please speed. I am in a hurry, okay? Yeah. Just hurry up. As a token of my love for you. As a token of my love for you. To keep and to cherish. To keep and to cherish. Forever. Forever. Amen. Amen. God put your hands together. <laughs> now, Sophia, take and give to your group. And repeat after me. Tony, Tony, I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a token of my love for you. As a token of my love. To keep and to cherish. To keep and to cherish. Forever. Forever. Amen. 
I said, not... sorry, you are not allowed here. Please, delete yourself out of this place. I don't want to embarrass you. I will not be embarrassed. Thank you very much. I never got out. It's back a while more. I'm waiting. I will stand here and wait. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. I declare you husband and wife. <laughs> Fighting. Let's slow this fighting. If only this love could be left to grow. I've seen lots of people tie their knots even only because of their bond. So let us hold on strong. Cause love always wins it all. Just wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go, 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 go. Ah! You want to go back to me? Ah! Oh, God. 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 Oh, God.
myself here. Feel free, go ahead. It's been long I went to see my parents at the village. I'd really love to go this weekend. It's fine. I don't have a problem with you going to see your parents. For as long as you want to be long. Yeah. I know how lonely it is out here when you want to go home. Yeah, no. Two weeks. Just two weeks. Okay. For that job I have with UNICEF, I would have said we go together. It's okay, I'm going to go. Right? Can we sleep now? Yes. Come on. Ah. You'll be fine. Are you trying to tell me you don't understand the level of witchcraft those people are Asian people? In 2009? It doesn't matter. <laughs> Thank you. If your wife is missing her mom like she said you, she told you, the best thing is just to invite the mom over. Simple. Rather than letting her go all that way. <laughs> really? Let's just cut the conversation, alright? Because it's, it's useless. She's already traveled. What are we discussing? It's okay. I'm just being concerned. <laughs> By the way, I forgot. Here, let's go through it and tell me what you think. That's a minute. Yeah. 
bring me up. Aren't you going to give your mother a welcome hug? Did I not tell you? Did I not warn you that whenever you come into my house, you need to notify me? You mean I have to notify you before coming to your house? I actually have to write an application letter to come and see my own son? Yes. Yes. Are you not the one that cursed my marriage? Are you not the one that said you want to make it miserable for me? Are you not the one? So I need to be prepared for all your nonsenses and your troubles when you walk in this house. Notify me. You know what? You can say all the rubbish you like. I don't care. The important thing is that I know what your problem is and I am here to solve it. That's a lie. You know nothing about my problems. And even if you did, you're the last person I'll come and see. You are a good mother. Simple. Her name is Juliet, and um, her bride price is already been paid. She's your new bride. So why don't you just give her a sweet smile? Now well, listen to me, young woman. I am a married man. I have a wife. And her name is Sophia. I can never be with you. Now you must. You better take your so-called bride and get out of my house if I do something that you'll regret both of you because you don't know me. Get out. I don't care what her is you're saying, all right? All I know is that Juliet and I are here to stay and there's nothing you can do about it. Look, Juliet, most other women would tell you to stand with one leg. I, Madam Bacchus, I'm telling you to stand with on the ground. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> what he has as a wife is a man. And too many, you know, my darling, cannot live in the same house. So just relax and maybe she gets in some place. Okay. Good idea. <laughs> Slipping in the wrong with you, understand me? What's the problem? My mother stinks, man. She sucks. Yeah, what? What happened? I got home from work yesterday. Only for me to see my mother, that she's brought some girl. The village, she's paid the girl's right price and she's brought the girl to be my new bride. Can you imagine? What? Yeah, I can you imagine? <laughs> That's ridiculous. Anyway, well, you can't be serious. Hmm? Has it gotten to this level? You know, she, she's, that she, she's come to live with me in my house. Without even asking my permission, she just looked around, got one room. Told the girl to stay. It's crazy. See what I told you? Might not be vindicated now. I believe if Sophia was around, your mom wouldn't have the audacity to bring another woman into the house. So what are you gonna do now? Are you planning? I don't know. I don't know. You know my, my head is so full. You know, I'm just going to just ignore that. Just ignore them. Ignore? You don't ignore such thing. Just send the girl back in. You've got to send her away before she gains ground in the house and begins to insult your wife when she comes back. I agree. Totally agree with you. But my mom, she's going to live in my house. Yeah. Look, wait, my mind is just messed up thinking about Sophia. I have too many things in my mind. I'm just going to ignore her. I think that's what I'll do. I mean, I don't understand. Your mom lives with you right now in the house. Yes. As crazy as it sounds. 
She lives in my house with the girl. She's come that's gonna live in the house. She's locked up her own. 